We're putting some straight questions to Naveen Jindal, uh, tycoon come Congress MP. For the past few weeks, uh, Naveen Jindal has been quietly battling the onslaught of a very strong opposition attack on Colgate. Today, the member of parliament on being questioned by a television reporter lost his school, snapped back. In fact, hit out at the camera person himself. Clearly, the pressure is showing on Naveen Jindal, whose company is under the scanner over the coal allocations. Pressure clearly showing on Jindal as he faces a slew of allegations from the opposition. Bharti Janta Party ki mang hai ki coal block ka avantan cancel kiya jaye. Bharti Janta Party ki mang hai ki independent jan isme jaanch karai jaye aur Pradhan Mantri iske zimmedari le. Lekin is sarkar mein koi zimmedari lene ko tayyar nahi. I would say that these allegations are absolutely uh, baseless and both uh, Jindal Steel and Tata Sasol were given one block each in Odisha. Facing the heat from the principal opposition party, Jindal hit back at BJP for hurling baseless allegations. For uh, BJP to make allegations against the Congress uh, MP, I think it is only, uh, only expected. Now because I am in politics, I am representing uh, people of Kurukshetra in the parliament, I am a Congress MP, so now all these allegations are being made. Which, are, which is quite uh, unfortunate. While the government promises to look into all allegations, the opposition continue to pile on the pressure. So, where you even as Naveen Jindal continues to staunchly defend himself against all allegations against his company, the government feeling the pressure of the opposition's tirade as more and more politicians' names come tumbling out in the investigations into the Colgate scam.